Hello guys, Woohoo here, back with another video, this time around a smaller one and probably one that most people know, but somebody asked me on the Discord and I thought I actually never made a video of talking about when the daily reset is and also when the weekly reset is for Trove. So I will link in the description a con time converter on time and date if you want to go check that one out, but I'll put the times on screen as well here, a few cities, but if your city is, you know, one specifically, you can go there and enter that one and just enter uh, Denmark, which I am in as well, because I'm going to go from the time so I am in, because that's the one I know. So let's start out. This is of course going to be summertime. You just have to put it back one more hour. I'll also put that on the screen at the end uh, when we go through it. But I want to talk about daily reset first uh, because it kind of ties into the weekly reset as well. So the daily reset starts uh, is every day at 1 p.m. my time. That's in Denmark, 1 p.m. Uh, that's noon when we are in winter time. Uh, if you live in Los Angeles, for example, in, in the past, as, as time zones are, it's going to be 4 a.m. for you, and it's going to be 7 a.m. if you live in New York. So that's the time between that. You probably know better if you play or live in the United States of America. You know what time zones probably better are compared to when it's New York and it's Los Angeles. So that's the Americans. Like I said, in Central Europe, that's where I live, uh, that's Denmark, that's 1 p.m. for the, like I said, the summertime and then noon when it is winter time. But if you live on the other half, well not really the other half, but the, on, the, on the future basically, <laughs> so there is Hong Kong, we're just going to take Hong Kong, we're also going to take Sydney, but we'll start with Hong Kong. And of course there's a lot of time zones between that as well, but you know, I guess you can kind of go whatever that would be but if you are in hong kong you will be that would be 7 p.m at night so that would be night time for you not like late night but it would be fairly early in the night but it's still 7 p.m if you live in hong kong if you are further down and further i guess even further in the future you will be in sydney so we're going to take sydney because that's a little bit further and i know there'll be a bunch of people also playing in Australia. So that will be 9 p.m. for you when the, the reset daily does that. So 9 p.m. for Sydney and, oh, well, not most of Australia because Hong Kong is kind of the same place, but anyway. But that's how, when, and the daily reset every single day for all the time zones that are out there. So now we know when the daily reset happens every single week. And now we're going to talk about the weekly reset. So there's also a weekly reset where all your tomes resets, all your, uh, all the, you know, all the contests and stuff like that resets. And that resets on a Monday on the time where the daily reset happens. So for me, it happens 1 p.m. as it's summertime right now, 1 p.m. on Mondays, it reset and then everything you know, comes together and then the whole new week, you can get to do your delves again and stuff like that. Well, you can still do the delves, but you get the rewards, you know, your Luna Zone, Titan Zones, just more divinities and whatnot from the delves on Mondays. That's also the day where, you know, it is delve day on Monday. So yeah, if you're feeling like you're not getting enough because it might not have reset yet. So make sure you check out, of course, when you do click uh, in game, you can also see it by hitting the F1 button. I don't know what the key bind is for uh, all the other uh, consoles and stuff like this. But if you hit F1, it is going to show you right here that it's gathering day right now. You can see all the different days. And of course, you can always check that. So if it's still like it was, if it would still be Monday, then of course the reset hasn't happened yet. So you can also find this, uh, you know, welcome menu as it's also called. You can also find that in the hub. There's a basic uh, thing where you can go check that one out. But that's all the time conversions that were there. And this is when the reset happens. This is when your tomes are going to be available again, the re non repeatable ones, of course. So yeah, I don't want to make this video too long. It's just kind of talking about this reset. And like I said, this is common knowledge to many, many people, but you know, there might be a few out there and I want to bring as much information out there. And I didn't know that some people didn't know. So now you know <laughs> a lot of knowing and a lot of talking so i hope you guys still enjoyed this smaller video just on what the resets are and when they are happening and again go to the description there is the time conversion uh thing where you can find where it's it's basically all 
mapped out. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.